Hi guys, it's Becky. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you're already subscribed, thanks for coming back. Today, I'm starting off another haul video, and there's no better way to start than a massive, chunky package from Little Balloon Papery. Have been waiting a while for hers uh, to come. Um, she was she did she, she just it was busy. She it was busy, and and they're here now. That's all that matters. I've got a little note. It says I've been working on kit reformats, and I really wanted to finish this kit to be able to send it to you. Ooh, I know how much you like the blossom colorway, so I figured you might also like this matching kit. I'm soon bringing out a mix of foil and non-foil kits, and if I will be, and if. And it, sorry, and it will be one of the new releases. I've also added a few of the new extra in the Blossom colorway. Hope you like them, Chris. Oh, Chris, I'm sure I will. I've got two. Which ones do I do? Do I do the thin one? Do I do the thick one? Oh, let's do the thin one. Let's do the thin one. I love her packaging. Like, you can keep it. Ooh. You can keep it and use it for planner setups, guys. Keep the dots keep the dotted paper so i am a pr for um little bloom papery as you know i've got a discount code down below and i do get um credit every month that i can go on and pick a few things out but like you've just seen she always adds little extra bits in as well so that we can see the new releases and things so if you do like anything that you see then head on over there and don't forget to use my discount code down below you know, I have to be transparent and say all that with you because, you know, I don't... I do spend my own money in these shops as well um, as the credit, but, you know, I just wanted to be transparent in the fact that I get credit. So this is the Blossom kit. This kit is stunning. This kit, sorry. Um, Chris has took Kobe to the vets to get his spinal injection and Nico's not happy that he's been left behind. Uh, look at it. Look at these boxes. I mean, it just screams. And that bike... Oh my god, I've got a bike like that. I just need some flowers to put it in. Look at the bottom washi. So we've got bottom washi, we've got dividers, we've got a little Polaroid box there. We've got loads of functionals. We've got, oh, look at the Monday through Sunday scripts. Oh, they're so delicate. I love little corners. You should make your own box and loads more functionals and then I always get the add-ons don't I? I always have to get little add-ons for little so we've got some Polaroid boxes there they're really nice for in the daily pages as well if you can print out a little picture and then we've got some um cloud kind of like watercolor effect and then some smaller boxes which you can use as check boxes or not and then um some little scrap papers as well so I think this is the kit she's on about that she sent. It's stunning. I do love the blossom colourway. It's right up my street. So let's let. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. Here's everything. Right. Let me take everything out the plastic, and then I'll be back. Okay, so that's everything out of the plastic and then I've got two little freebies so I've got this little strawberry one and then I've got this one I mean you could just get away with using those two boxes in a Hobonichi planner Hobonichi weeks and then some washi tape and you've got your decoration so I'm going to go through the big sheets first so I get most of her stuff on two for two Tuesday two for two Tuesday is basically you're getting two sheets for two pound. I mean, I haven't found anywhere that does better deals than that. They normally do like one sheet for two pound, but you get two sheets for two pounds and two for two Tuesday is always on. So she updates it every month or couple of months or whenever, but they're always there, not just on a Tuesday. So literally two for two Tuesday is where it's at. So I picked up this peony set because just why wouldn't you look at the colors in that so that's the deco and then this is a two page kit now i love using her kits in my cousin i've done it a couple of times now and just loved this is one of her kits that wasn't that's one of her kits as well. I just think they're absolutely stunning, especially with clear icons. It's just the way that the kit is formatted. Like, there's loads of boxes 
all of these boxes that you can use and write on that will fit in the Hobie Nietzsche Cousin. And you're getting two corners pieces there, you're getting two corner pieces there, another one there, a topper there. It's just absolute, and another corner piece there. So you're getting so much to use in a uh, in a in a, a um, spread. And then you can get extras. This is a large sheet because I like to use them in my daily pages as well. But you can get the smaller sheet as well. Next up, Daisy. Oh, I fell in love with this paper. Is at, did she say she changed her paper? This is absolutely gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Oh my God, look at this. Look at it, guys. Is it capturing the detail? Look at that. So that is the, um, the deco, and then this is the two sheet. I'm gonna have to order this one again. I know I'm going to have to order this one again. I'm trying to show you the detail of this kit and the colours. They're so neutral. Oh, I love it. And then we've got Peachy. So this is the large deco for Peachy. I have got small decos for them and matching boxes and things, but they'll be in this one. Oh, and then this is the Peachy kit. Oh my god. Oh god, it's just stunning. I've got no other words for it. Honestly guys, if you haven't ordered from her, I know I say this all the time and I feel really bad because I'm such an enabler, but if you haven't tried, just try a couple of her pages on the two for two, you won't be, look this is Ruby. My mother-in-law would love this, she likes um she likes poppies, but these are like really bright and red. They're so vivid. They're so vivid. And the blue and the red and the light pink. Do you know the um, the iMac when they bought out the pink and then they put the red on the back? And I was like, why'd they do that? That looks stupid. These go so well. Oh my God, I'm, I'm in love. So what I'm going to do in front of me is just put them in little piles because I know that the mini stuff is going to correlate to all of this so just to make it a bit easier for me not for you for me I want it to be easier for me <laughs> yes we've got those right so here we go let's go with the smaller ones let's bring it down I want to be conscious that I'm not bringing you down too far uh, because you, you don't like me chopping off the bottom, do you? But this is the smaller deco. You can see the size difference of the pieces of deco. And these are the ones that I like to add into my spread to fill in any gaps. So that matches the peony. And then I've got the peony toppers, which look stunning. Did I do it in here? I think that's when I use the toppers across the top. Yeah, I've done it in this one. See how I've used them across the top of the days? Just makes it, honestly guys, makes it these little things. They make it. So we've got the peony toppers and then we've got the medium daisy. Oh God. Oh God, they're just, they're, they're gorgeous and then we've got the daisy toppers and then we have we've got some date covers not really sure what they go with and we've got some i think it's just a nude nude range and then we've got some splash of watercolor some boxes some watercolor boxes some more boxes so, some more boxes some more boxes i do remember ordering all of these uh, these are really cool to use in your hobonichi weeks they're really really good um and then oh hold on let's let's keep those out separate right so i'm guessing yeah these match the daisy the daisy one because i'm like why would i have ordered all them they match the daisy um so i got those at the same time this matches the peony 
So we've got the date covers, yeah, all the same again. We've got the date covers, the watercolour splotches, the more boxes, more boxes. Because I wanted to be able to use these, not only use them in my Home and Each Cousin, but I want to be able to use them in my Stalgy as well. And you can never have enough of these boxes. I tend to separate them out. I keep them all together initially when I first use the kit and then I separate them out so I've always got extras. And then we've got the Ruby Small. We've got some Ruby Toppers. We've got some Peachy Toppers and some Peachy Small. And then these go with the Peachy. So we've got all of these boxes for the peachy. I don't think I got the boxes for the ruby. Is that? No, I think these. Are these the boxes for the... Which ones are these for? Yeah, they are. It throws me off because I have the, um, the big deco on top. But these are the ones for the peachy. Oh, love it all. And then these look like they're little extra extras. And this is on her clear paper, which feels amazing. Look at those. I think you get the option as well to foil these. That is stunning. Yeah, it's clear. Look, that's stunning. Oh, no. She's giving me icons. Oh no. I love me an icon. Especially a clear one. So we've got earbuds. We've got shopping. We've got a little birthday present. Oh, got trainers. For the oh, we got TV. And we got some washing. Oh my God. This, these are stunning. I'm going to have to build a collection of Lily Blossom icons now as well, aren't I? So, yeah, that is all of those kits that I got. Honestly, so, if I do it for this one, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, all of that would be eight pounds. Because it's a pound a sheet, basically. So eight pounds for a Hobonichi cousin kit plus loads of extras. I don't know where you're going to get that kind of um, value for money from. I really don't. I don't know how she does it. I really, really don't. But it's absolutely stunning, and I'm in love with this. So this is her new kit format. Let's have a look at, just because I'm interested, let's have a look at an old kit format, shall we? So we know what we're getting. I hoard hers, look, I've got loads, I hoard them. I hoard them, I'm a hoarder. Right, let's just get this um, sweet love one out, which is gorgeous as well. One in our room. I'm running out of room. Sorry. I've got everything on my desk, guys. I've got all my study stuff that I need to do and yada, yada, yada. So, we have... So, I've noticed a difference already with the branding. She's taken off the, the line at the top and the bottom and it's more of a clean look. And then the name is at the bottom, whereas the name's on the side there. So that is the four boxes and then so this would be the washi so the washi is the same the headers she's just changed these ones and then we've got a bigger box there so we, we haven't got these boxes so she's done the washi all the way across rather than um, a shorter one and a longer one so she's changed that And then, so this page, the I think the scripts generally change on her kits anyway. But instead of the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, she's wrote it in on this one. So this is a little bit of a different format. We've got some icons at the top and then some, we've got extra functionals here. We've got extra functionals here. 
We've still got the checklists. We've still got two habit trackers. We've still got these, but instead of the flags, we've got the corners. And then we've got the functional boxes. So there's not massive, massive changes, but there is enough changes to where I can see a difference. So yeah, that is my little order from Little Bloom Papery. So I have some more goodies to show you. So the lovely Leah, which ha she's got a uh, a channel on YouTube called, let me just get it for you, Clueless About Art. This is her channel. Um, she does um, similar videos to me really. You should uh, definitely go over and check her out. But she has started a, a new project and she reached out to me and asked me if I would like review her subscriptions for her. So her subscriptions are in the format of vellum. So there's two sets of subscriptions that you can get and there's a theme every single month. So you can get what she calls the chic or the kawaii. Now, when I first looked through these vellums, I was a bit confused about a few things. So I did message her because I wanted to get those things clarified before I uploaded this video because you guys know I'm 100% transparent with you guys and things just weren't making sense to me. Um, first off, um, this vellum pack that I've got here, which I am going to show you all the bits of paper in a minute, this is what she called the chic version, and, and chic to me is like elegant and, and, and things like that, and this wasn't coming across in that way. Also, I will show you this first piece of, oh, in fact, let me just show you the freebie you get if you use my code. So, you get coffee cups with pink leopard print behind, I mean, that if that's not a reason to subscribe, then I don't know, just to get my freebie. Um, so, in each pack, you get one two, three, four, five pieces of vellum. I'm going to show you this one first. This confused me, I'm not going to lie. The theme for this is Mexico. Um, I didn't understand the um, the skulls, but then my husband told me it. they have the Day of the Dead in Mexico and it's a festival or something. It's a Mexican holiday, and, but it's not until November, so that confused me. But um, the theme overall was just Mexico. She didn't intend for it to be like Day of the Dead or anything. It's just Mexico. What I didn't understand was this calendar in the middle of the vellum. I was like, well, that doesn't make sense. It does make sense, however, because it's so you can cut this out to be whatever size, to fit whatever size planner you want, which I actually think is a genius idea because a lot of people, they always want a background around their calendar. So like for a monthly setup, I could just literally cut around here and stick it into whatever planner I'm using and I've got the month already there. Um, the print quality of these papers are amazing. You can see, you'll see more when I show you the bright ones and the thickness of them. They're a little bit thicker than uh, the Rebel Ink Co, but not as thick as the Planner Spot ones, but they are really good. Um, thickness for tipping in your planner so this is the first and you will get um, the the month uh, and I've got a sneak peek of next month as well so you will get the month uh, and what with whatever background so for a vellum pack whether you pick the kawaii or whether you pick the chic the chic I think she's gonna change the name to like be me to be more realistic because kawaii is made up isn't it it's more fake it's cutesy it's it's um, all that kind of stuff whereas realistic is realistic like it's not fake although schools are fake I don't know it's that's that confuses me but you know I, I've been chatting with her because originally I wasn't going to upload this video because I didn't want to be negative but there are a lot of positives and this is an ongoing thing and you know people have different tastes and one of one of the months it might be something and i'm like oh my god i need 10 of these so i do want to show you them the print quality is amazing it goes edge to edge that's one thing i've noticed on a lot of vellums they don't always go edge to edge um so that is absolutely gorgeous so then the next sheet we've got is this look how vibrant those colors are i mean it's showing up true to color on camera as well that is absolutely stunning if I take the theme and the and the names of the collections out of my head as individual sheets of vellum I really really like them you are going to be able to buy them 
after the subscription as individual sheets but it'll work out like three pounds more cheaper with the postage included as well because you'll have to buy the sheets and pay postage where if you get the subscription you get all the sheets and the postage is included um but yeah this this one i'm just wow like this is my favorite this is my favorite out of the um the chic set so far i do love this one as well i've never tried this fruit i love these leaves and i, I genuinely do love the the quality and everything it just to me it just feels a little bit um mix matched at the minute but she's only just starting out you know it's it's like she, she's she's trying she wants to do something and she's just finding her feet now i know a lot of you are going to love this there's a lot of people that love schools and things i mean my hubby he loves this it's it's on a like a cream background as well and they're so pretty i'm not a school person personally but i can appreciate a good school when i see a school what did you say you said school 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 it's skull it's not a skull <laughs> i'm saying school which is what it is what, what are you calling it? Skull. Isn't, skull hasn't got an A in it. Skull. Where's the A in skull? I'm not saying that with A. I'm You're saying skull. skull. <laughs> I'm saying skull. <laughs> that was the stupidest word in the world ever. They're skulls, aren't they, people? Anyway, who invited him? Um, and then we get this one, avocado. Who doesn't love an avocado? Again, I really, really like this one. But this one I would, I would call chic. You know, with the... I just... I just think that chic is a more um is a more um neutrally kind of thing. So maybe, you know, in the future she might bring in some more of that kind of neutral style because not everybody likes these big bright colours in your face and not everybody likes the kawaii, which I'm gonna show you in a minute, but they do like neutral. So maybe just to alleviate that. So this is like the more realistic um, colour patterns of the theme and then I will show you the next pack so this is the kawaii pack and again you get you're getting the four pieces of vellum look at this this is gorgeous I absolutely am obsessed with llamas this is getting tipped in somewhere llamas cacti with pink flowers I absolutely adore this. I love it. And then we get this. If you know what fruit this is, oh, this one, let me know down below. But isn't that cute? At first I was like, oh, that's a bit scary. Like some alien dude with green fingers. <laughs> but it's actually quite cute. It, can you see how bright these colours are, guys? They're absolutely stunning. Then we've got some more little cheeky avocados on a real pale... I'm putting it against the white so you can see it's a really pale green background with that one and then this one guys if that doesn't scream kawaii and mexico then i do not know what does this would be perfect for a july august you know kind of june july august setup this is absolutely stunning and then the sneak peek that i have for august is this it's ropes so i'm thinking i'm thinking like sailing or something like that um yeah so yeah the um the vellum packs are £8.95 each you can also you can also get the washi so I, I got two washes because she's so kind she gave me a freebie she gave me some other stuff stuff, stuff which I'm going to show you in a minute as well but yeah this washi so to get the vellum pack and the washi is £10.50 and my maths ain't mathing Chris mm -hmm. what is £10.50 take away £8.95 what's going to do this in my head £10.50 take away £8.95 carry the one uh, £1.55 so you're getting this vellum for £1.55 how cute is that I love the black. I love the black detailing on there. With those little... Is it papaya fruit? I don't know what the fruit is. Yeah, so you can get the vellum and the washi for £10.50. And then you can get the vellum, the washi and the mystery gift. Which this month is... 
a little cactus pin. I mean, come on, if you haven't got a pencil case with pins st stuck all over it, are you, not, are you even a planner? Planner? Mm. Because I've got one right next to me, but it's got things piled on it, and I'm scared if I pull it out, everything's going to fall off. I love these. I do like the metal ones, you know, the magnetic ones, but these, you know, it ain't going anywhere. Yeah, that is gold on the back. And then again, really bright colours and really easy, easy little pin to do. So, I've told you all that. I've told you her name on YouTube, but that is not her name in real life. Her name in real life is Leah and she is, this is her details, Charter 81 Stationery and you can hashtag charter81 vellum um so uh, i have got a discount code guys i'll leave it down below go and have a look uh, she did send me uh, another freebie she sent me a freebie washi tape which i'm going to show you you can never have too much washi tape can you she also is a stockist for wonderland 222 uh, planners and if you haven't seen the Wonderland 222 A4 all-in-one unstacked, unstacked, yes guys, you heard that right, weekends, then um, what are you doing? Because it's, oh, I love the background of that. I think Willow's going to steal this. Willow's definitely going to steal this and some of the vellum, I just know it. I know her little, like, picky fingers is going to have her hands all over it. Uh, Wonderland um, 222. Yeah, go and have a look on uh, Leah's website and all the different options are there and there's so many guys and there's different coloured notebooks and everything. Uh, I've made a cheeky little order and, oh, I cannot wait. But we'll, I'll talk about that in a different video because I'm going to do a, a video about that. So, that is her subscription. So, 8 95 just for the vellum packs, whichever one you want. The vellum and the washi is 10 50 Vellum washi and mystery is 17 91 And uh, have I mentioned everything that I wanted to mention? Yeah, I mean, I just want to say, and like I said to her as well, I just want to be honest, but you can't please everyone every month. So one theme, you may absolutely love it, and then the next one, you don't. I mean, that happened to me with the DEK design subscriptions, like, loads of times, didn't it? So I'm going to show you these. These are the planners that she has on her website, and I'm pretty sure that this one is 1995. Let Oh, I'm already on the page. Yeah, this one is $19.99, and this is the A6 one, and it's $15.99. So I'll show you the A6 one first. It comes with a plastic cover. It comes with a plastic cover, guys. I'm just, like, amazed by that. It also comes in um, black, mustard, or mint colours. So this is obviously the mint. Uh, the A5 does come in different colours. Um, so this is uh, this is version two. It's life in pieces. Your planner. This is your planner for six months, and then we open it up, and this is a really thick piece of cardstock, and it's got your planner. That page that always sticks to that page, but in the back, I think it's got a page yeah where you can write. I'm liking that planners are doing this now. Um, so it's an undated planner. It's got daily, weekly and monthlies. There's 240 pages. It's a PVC cover and we've got extra eight pages for notes and it's made in South Korea and it's 100 GSM premium paper. So it's not Tomo River paper, it's premium paper. So when you open it up, you get this little um, like yearly overview page. Now, Casey, Casey, my daughter is just starting her GCSEs she's doing her mock exams at the minute she's bags in this she's like please can I have that because she can write down everything for school you'll get you get your 12 monthlies uh, please ignore that that was my hands they're all undated I love the way that the monthly is set out you can just write the month and then put the dates in you've got a space for important and a space for goals and then you get all your monthlies at the front and then 
you get a weekly overview page and then it goes into your daily pages. So this weekly overview page is perfect for Katie to write in what lessons she's got when and then she can write any homework in the to-do lists. She can track something. She, she does like to track things. Casey, Casey loves her uh, astrology. I've got her in love with astrology. And then you've got your days which are undated. You just date them. I'm just going to get her to sit down and just date the whole thing ready for... This is perfect for her because it can run for six months when she starts back at school. You've got your three little bullet points at the top. She can put here things that she needs to remember to take in because I've told her to start bringing books home so she can revise a bit better. If she needs to take the books back in, she's going to write it there. And then this she said she's just going to use for notes or scribbling on during the day or any information that she's given. You do get a timeline that goes from one in the morning through to 11 um, and you get midday. The timeline is um, normal timeline, one through 12, and 1 through 11. Um, I'm used to 24 hour timeline. We're trying to teach Casey the 24 hour timeline but she's used to that. But uh, also you get these little boxes next to it. If you did want to write a list, I like that because you can just check off the boxes. It's got a tiny, tiny grid. This grid is tiny so you I would just ignore the grid and you've got notes at the bottom and then tomorrow so you've got your Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday and then you get your weekly again and then your month starts and then that happens all the way to the end where then we see uh, um, eight extra note pages at the back which just look like this they've just got a line the grid and a line and yeah that that's it and that is 15.99 and i just think that is such a bargain chris tried to fit it in his um i think he's got a pocket planner i don't know the size i bought it for me um this leather cover and he stole it off me and he's trying to find a pan plan to fit it but yeah casey casey wants this for her gcse's which i just think as well for kids like A6 planners, they're just perfect size, aren't they, for their blazers, for their um, uniforms. One thing I probably will do is get her one of the snap closures, the Midori belt clips. So one of these belt clips, I'll probably get her one, just so she can keep that closed when she's throwing it in and out of her bag. Now, this one, this one, guys, I was like, ooh, I am... Um, I'm going through a planner crisis right now. I'm trying to figure out what planners I want to use for 2024, which obviously means that I've got more. I've got more planners, more planners coming because I'm, I'm stupid and I can't stop. Please help me. But I saw this and I was like, why did you get a take, take the note planner when you could have just used this? Again, this is for six months. You can get it in the violet, which is this colour. You can get it in the olive. I really, really like the look of the olive colour. In fact... Oh, in fact, do I need to buy it? Ah, uh, right. So this is a little bit different. Exactly the same um, design, though. Um, this is an A5 size. It's got a PVC cover. It's got a yearly plan, monthly plan, weekly plan. There's only 122 pages in this one. And the paper is 100 uh, GSM. So this one is thinner than the A6 because you're not getting a day to a page on this. So we open it up, we've got the cover, and then we've got this little cover here, nice thick piece of cardstock there. And then you've got this half year um, yearly overview, um, like, I don't know what people call these, like habit trackers. You can put whatever day, month you start there. It's got numbers one to 31, and then you can just write whatever you want in there or do your dots, your zig dots or whatever it is whatever it is you're tracking and then we've got the half year list so you write the month in and then you've got four boxes i thought this was really cool because you could just put four goals in there you could put four pictures in there of the month you know like if you're on a diet you can do the beginning and the end of the month and then two of your favorite meals or something um you can write yeah anything like i really like that half year thing and then we move on to the monthly i think this is a really really good size monthly uh, they have got a memo strip down the side an important at the bottom and a goals at the bottom there and then you've got a bit of a gap from the top 
The writing is uh, in like a light grey. Uh, this is the monthly overview. Again, for an undated planner, absolutely perfect. You, you're getting your 12 months of monthlies. And then, guys, wait, wait, it's going to get exciting. Then this. This is what you this is what you see. I know it's probably hard for you to see. Um, you've got a space to put what week it is. You've got your weekly overview, so Monday through Friday, Saturday and Sunday. You've got some task uh, there with the with the Alistair method of ticking them off. You've got a to do list at the bottom and some notes, and then it's two days per page. Again, you've got the same timeline: the one till twelve, and then the one till eleven. You've got the notes, you've got tomorrow, you've got notes and tomorrow from each day. You've got four bullet points at the top. You can use this for journaling, you can use it for a time daily, you can use it for goals. You can, like, literally, this, people who get overwhelmed with the Hobonichi Cousin, with the journaling in the Hobonichi Cousin, absolutely fell in love with the Take a Note because of this layout. Because if you think, writing on, in that strip there, instead of because i know there's notes pages that it's very very intimidating isn't it that little block compared to that so yeah for 19.99 for a six month planner i think this is absolutely worth it so you get in your weekly you get monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday and then you get your weekly overview and then a blank page which i think is really really good this can be for your uh, sorry because sunday's there weekly review oh i did that wrong monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sorry then you get sunday and then you get a weekly review oh look you can tip happiness productivity satisfaction uh good bad next week so that's a really nice way to make you just do a, a mini review of your week then you're getting a blank page you can use this for mind mapping you can use it for a mood board you can use it for recipes you can use it for a washi um um, graveyard people when they're planning they just stick washi down you can use it for lists there's, there's like hundreds of ways you can use it and then you start again you go on to the weekly layout and then you get Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday weekly review blank page I'm definitely going to give this a go I'm definitely 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 going to give it going to give it a go um, yeah I really really like that I definitely think you need to check out the um charter81.com it'll be linked down below website and have a look at these for yourself because they just feel really really good let's just do a quick pen test shall we pen test on this paper okay so this is my Energel cleaner and it's in 0 0.5 Pen test, bring you down, is it going to, like, it's not bled through, a little bit of ghosting, and it's dry, I mean, I haven't got, I haven't got any of my pens with me, I get, Chris took them all away from me, I got them. Um, no, no, it's okay, uh, what, what have I got here? I wanted to use, I've got a felt tip pen, here we go, which is going to be very water based, because these are 100 GSM aren't they, again little bleed, little um, ghost in, no bleed through, let's use, let's use a Tombow, but go over it a few times. Again, no bleed through, but there is a... I wonder if this dries straight away, because I left it quite a while, didn't I? Yeah, that is really good. That that dried instantly. So this is going to... This, this paper is going to take a lot. So yeah, that is everything I got from Charter81. Definitely go over there and have a look and see. And if you're interested in the Take a Note Planner, then don't make the mistake I did and get a Take the Note Planner in Taiwanese or whatever. Um, give one of these a go because it's the same format, it's the same size, um, the same amount of writing space. 
So, right, that is that. And then I've got a few more things to show you. I've got my um, Planner Spot subscription. And then I've got my Coffee Monster Co subscription. I'm not a fan. I, I'm not a fan. I'm not going to lie. I don't know why she's done... Um, I mean, everyone's going to get her stuff because they love her. Well, not everyone loves her, but the majority of people do. Um, I don't know why she's done October in in May. I, I, genu I genuinely have no idea. Um, this is really cute. It's got the sparkly hollow with the cauldron and the ghosts. I don't understand why she did this. She said she just wanted to, which, okay, you do you. This is This is cute. This is cute. This can be tipped in. My camera's not picking up the colours very well, but there is purple in there. I just, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it, guys. Um, these are the May Doodles. So we've got some little emotes planning and making potions. And this is the, it's a little bit nicer than her normal paper. And then we've got these little ghost cauldrons little box to write on there and then we've got some little heads and then we've got these washi stickers I think they're on clear are they on clear yeah they're on clear oh these are date covers Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday and then two extra there and then we've got some mini dots so that is the one of the subscriptions the pen pal I think one from the Coffee Monster Co. And then we move on to the Planner Spot. That, and then I'm going to end this haul because it's been a long one. So the Planner Spot. I love the Planner Spot. And now I've been using it more, haven't I? In my functional planner, I've been using it. So we get this out of office card. I really like that. I really, really like that. And then the Planner Spot details on the back. And then we get some vellum. See what I mean about the these vellums are really, really thick. Really thick. This is bent. Um, it must have got bent in transportation. Um, I feel like I feel like we're getting quite similar. You know, I'm truthful with you guys. I feel like we're getting quite similar kind of things with the vellums. I think they need to um, like get not get a new design team, but try and come out, out with some things because we've had quite a few of these big flowers and these I'm not really a fan of these completely like blackout ones um but they're the vellums they're the vellums um the freebies I'm not I'm not as like oh like blown away with with this um with this subscription um because I think we've had better before but you're getting this little planner sticker as well which I love and then we're getting our July card so one side is Monday start the other side is Sunday start and then we're getting this salty card don't know why it says salty but it does and then this is one of the freebies and I'm like it's just a vellum pocket like anyone can make that it's like and then we've got a black pocket as well. And it's not even like it's got adhesive strips or comes with any adhesive strips to, to do it on your planner. And then this. This is the new and improved version. Have I still got it? If I've still got it, then it's a miracle because... <sighs> Have I still got it? Yes. Right. Guys, so if you've been with me for a while, you will have seen that she bought out this she bought out this temp this um stencil yeah guys this is floppy as hell you can't you can't hold it when you're holding it it's pulling apart like it really it really wasn't very good it really i get why she did it so thin she wanted it to be like perfect and stuff it didn't work it didn't work for me at all um i kept it i was going to relaminate it and then cut the holes out but like yeah i didn't i didn't get on with it at all so now she has given us a bigger improved version this is meant to be an improved version of the other one so I'm hoping that it will be and you've got a little 
three inch ruler there. It's a lot, lot thicker than, where's the other one? <laughs> I've just thrown it somewhere, haven't I? And it's gone. Oh no, here it is. So easy to lose this one. This is a hell of a lot thicker. And I think it's going to, like, let me show you. I bet you're going, Becky, just shut up and finish this haul, will you? So you're meant to be able to hold this somehow. It's, it's like, it's doable now when I've got nails on. No. And then, like, get a straight line. She said she couldn't do a thick one because it wouldn't be a straight line. To me, they're straight lines, so you can do a thick one. So yeah, I do. I do like that. I just feel like the um, the freebies I've just gone downhill a little bit. Right, last but my no means least is the sticker kit. I do love the sticker kit, and then. Oh, I wanted to walk and get the kids, but I'm running out of time. Um, Chris, can you get the dogs ready? So, Chris. So, we have this Chasing Daylight July add-on, which is, these are really, really cute. Really, really good for going to the beach. And then this is the July theme. Okay, the flowers, I get it. It's going with the vellum going with the vellum they are matching matching this green i absolutely love it oh yeah we're getting more green i do love that green you're getting two strips of washi here let me just show you quickly there and then you get two thin ones there your scripts your icons some deco i love these kits these kits to be used functionally are gorgeous they fit in the cousin as well so you're getting your full boxes some flags some little like headers the same width as the boxes you're getting your functionals your checklist your monday through sundays and then you're getting your graphs more icons and you're getting a load more scripts as well i have done quite a few um plan with me's on my channel using these kits so that's it guys that guy guys that is the end of this haul i think my next haul is going to be what i'm doing for my uh, 2024 planners because i've just got i've just yeah i need to have a word myself so i hope you enjoyed this haul guys if you did give me a thumbs up and i'll see you in my next one bye